Hey, how's it going everyone? It's uh, Sylvain here. Welcome again for another uh, video. So here I am with uh, my some new equipment. So I still have my uh, Logitech uh, Brio uh, camera. Let me know how it uh, shows now with the new computer. Hopefully it works uh, works a bit better. I'm going to try to improve the quality. Got, uh, got a light up here, got a light kind of showing the background, trying to arrange and trying to get a bit more advanced in the, in the settings and stuff. So let me know what uh, what shows up on your device if it's if it's good uh, or not so that's going to help me improve my uh, the quality and so on i haven't been uh, i've never been like a big ed editor and stuff so let's let's try to improve that from uh, perspective on uh, today's video what i'm going to cover is i'm going to touch on uh, the coin geek uh, conference i'm going to cover uh, telos uh, news uh, they now have their new uh, erc20 uh, uh, token and also i'm going to talk about uh, some news involving the project uh, uh, polis which i covered uh, in the past a major change is coming up for for them so let's go right into it all right first news uh, i wanted to cover is uh, bitcoin sv uh conference uh, made by a coin geek uh, conference is happening on the uh, 8th uh, to the uh, 10th of, uh, of june we can see it here clearly on the website in 98 uh, days uh, you can uh, have a look here if you want to get more information you can also uh, register here on this tab that's going to take you to a registration uh, form uh, and then uh, i think they're talking about uh, gathering it virtually so most likely most people will be uh, virtual online and then there might be some uh, some people live from the actual uh, location but I think uh, what we can expect is mostly uh, online a version of a Kongi conference, which regroups a lot of uh, speakers and so on, everything business builders uh, on the Bitcoin SV ecosystem. So I recommend you check it out. And I'm certainly going to attend uh, this uh, coming up, uh, this one coming up. Uh. All right, so next uh, news at uh, Telos. Uh, so I've been talking about this project. I talked about it again on uh, my uh, French podcast as well. You can check out on anchor.fm. I'm going to put the link uh, in the description as well. So if you happen to be uh, a French or a Francophone, then you can uh, certainly check it out. I'm trying to uh, gather some uh, a nice community here in, the, in French. So I talked about uh, Telos. Uh, Telos, the uh, ticker sign, they're now on uh, the Ethereum blockchain using the uh, token uh, Telos, so ERC-20 token. Uh, it happened yesterday, so they raised uh, over 235 Ethereum uh, in three hours, so the value of the, uh, the liquidity pool for the ERC-20 token Telos, uh, which is, you know, a third-gen uh, blockchain built on uh, EOSIO uh, software, kind of similar to... Uh, to uh, EOS, but it, it's just a bit different. The governance, um, you know, they have the EVM now, Ethereum Virtual Machine, trying to scale, be compatible with Ethereum. So really, really nice uh, project that's coming up and they're doing great stuff. So recommend you go uh, check it out uh, on uh, there and you go to telos.net and you can get some uh, some news about uh, the, the project and so on, the, the roadmap, uh, different thing. There's a Telegram community as well. So recommend you go uh, check it out for yourself. Uh, and the following news, so I talked about uh, Polis. So it was a big announcement uh, yesterday. I wasn't expecting that. Uh, you know, they, they've been pretty quiet as of late. So I, I, I was like, not sure what to expect. But I decided to read the Medium post. And I was like, wow, there's quite a big uh, big news on their part. So Polis uh, 2.0, the new era. So uh, what's happening with uh, Polis? They're actually, uh, they had a project. Uh, uh, they were build, building their own protocol called the Olympus uh, Protocol. And after uh, about two years of uh, work, they decided to uh, put that aside and really uh, go towards the uh, Binance uh, smart chain. So the new home for uh, Polis. So as my understanding, there'll be uh, kind of a token on the uh, Binance smart chain. I'm assuming uh, this decision was based on Ethereum being, being super expensive. They do have a, uh, a wrap Polis that's, on, that's sitting on Ethereum now, but that's going to get uh, closed as well. So everything seems to be moving towards the, the Binance uh, smart chain. Expect a lot more details coming from them. Uh, also, I have questions for, for them, but I think I'm going to let the, the team uh, sort out uh, and make all the announcements. But it's something if, you're, uh, whole, uh, if you've if uh, you watched my videos before, we talked about uh, the Olympus protocol and so on. Uh, we've talked about Polis and what they're, they're doing. So a lot of things are about to change uh, with them. So stay tuned and uh, uh, recommend you go on either the, their Telegram, Discord, and really get the, the latest announcements. And if you're a holder as well, just... Uh, 
make sure you do that as a precaution to make sure that uh, you put your coins at the the proper location for the for the switch, which is happening really soon, by the way. I think they're uh, they had the new roadmap. If I go down below here, or maybe I skipped it. Uh, so March first, so it was announced yesterday. March fourth, police core update. Uh, 1.8.0 bridge to bsc opens march 4th so it's only in a couple days so uh, go do your homework uh, check the announcements all right so that's it for this uh, video hopefully you liked uh, this hopefully it was some uh, value uh, if you like this message make sure you subscribe hit the like uh, also notification as well to me uh, reminded of upcoming videos and on this again if you have any comments with uh, the, the cameras and lighting and so on let me know as well I'm trying to always improve uh, that's that's the goal here so uh, thanks again for uh, for watching and then we'll see you in the next uh, video bye bye